you might have heard the term CTE and wondered what it meant. CTE stands for Career Technical Education, and it's New York State's way of making sure that its students are ready for the workforce. There are lots of different possibilities for CTE classes, but you are probably curious about which classes that you could take at Hempstead High School. Should I put them on the spot? Yeah, let's put them on the spot. This is my computer class. They're learning how to build websites. And I didn't tell them that uh, I was putting them on the spot. Hello, sir. Hi. All right, let's do this. I got my website right here with the title. Yes, Hello. sir. All the work so far. Ooh. Yeah, put here documents. Documents too? Look. Yeah, like they work too, like. Made it sure they work. The Venn diagram one that you saw up there, and then this is a video part that you saw me and my friends playing soccer. Well when done, you... sir. That's a great yeah. website. Thank Quick you. answer. They don't know the question yet. How did this class change your life? Speak up, please. Um, I made money. Oh, he must be talking about one of the three ways that you could monetize websites, products and services, affiliate marketing, and advertising. I learned, I learned how to make a website. Yes, sir. Think of Bezos, you know, Amazon. I could put up like uh, blogs for like videos. Absolutely. Now let's go put more people on the spot. Now you might or might not have known that Hempstead High School has a cooking class. Hello everyone, my name is Sharon Diagelo. I'm Hempstead High School culinary arts teacher. Today we'll be using the biscuit method to demonstrate two dishes. We'll be making cheddar biscuit and homemade biscuit. Question is, do you get to eat what you cook in cooking class? Yeah, oh, yeah of course. Yeah. When you're done yeah, with do. everything, you're allowed to eat, you pack it up. That leads me to my next question. Okay. Like sometimes do you share with your friends? Yeah, sure. All the all the time. All the okay, all make, the time. That, that's just enough for everybody. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Has there ever been a time that you're like, oh my goodness, this is so good that I don't want to share with my friends? Yeah. Yeah. To be honest, yeah. <laughs> that's <laughs> awesome. Every time, honestly, but I share. Our next stop is going to be fashion class. Good morning. My name is Miss Gray, and I am the fashion design teacher here at Hempstead High School. My classroom is in room C203. Um, fashion design 2 is on um, the class where students mainly learn how to do pattern making um, and they're also learning how to sew. So they're learning the basics of sewing, um, how to stitch a needle, how to thread a needle, how to thread the machine, how to sew on a button, how to sew on a zipper, how to make pockets, and um, eventually they'll be making their own uh, garments. Uh, today they are learning how how to sew on buttons and also create and make buttonholes. Uh, my name is Ivani Stevens and this is my pouch I have made in a uh, fashion design. Uh, this could be cleaned up just a little bit but it's fine. Wow. Uh, I sewed buttons on it, oh clips, I'm not sure what those are but really cool. Thank you. So how are you going to take over the fashion world? Uh, I don't know. I'm not good at sewing. Coming through. Coming through? I'm not good at sewing, but I'd probably get into marketing. Like, you know. Who teaches marketing? This guy. Selling products, stuff like that. That's another CTE class. Yeah. Guess who teaches it? Oh. oh. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> what do you like about the class so far? I like sewing. I like hand stitching. I like everything that we learned so far. And did you know how to sew before taking this class? No. Did you know how to do anything with a sewing machine or a needle and thread? No. All right, so show me what you have done so far. This is my first project since I came to fashion and design. It's a hand pouch. Put stuff in it, get it open. So what are you looking forward to making in this class? Shirts. Shirts? All right, cool. Thank you. You're welcome. And now it is time for accounting class. Hey guys, my name is Stephanie and I'm currently a junior at Hempstead High School. So we have this accounting class and many of you guys probably 
are not interested in accounting, but I'll tell you a bit more about it. Accounting is the process of recording financial transactions and that pertain to business. But in simpler terms, I would say it's analyzing and keeping track of your spending and your earnings as a company or as an individual, which may seem difficult, and it is, don't get me wrong, especially if you're not a math person. But for our future CEOs and entrepreneurs, accounting is a vital skill to learn, not only because it helps you keep track of your how your business is performing, but it also helps you develop leadership skills and strategic thinking. And you get to work with money. Who doesn't love money? All in all, accounting is a great opportunity for aspiring business majors such as myself and those who just want to learn about the accounting world. And now it's time for my students to troll me about my marketing class. Now it's time to discuss marketing and I have some stars over here and they're going to tell us about marketing class and warn you about all of the work. <laughs> yeah, he gives too much work. Too <laughs> Why don't you tell me how you really feel? <laughs> After it's good. The Keep class going. is very fun. Aww. It's easy. All the work is there. If you really pay attention, you can actually get it. Even oh, though he'd be giving walking. us packets. Did you see that look? Right and on. Test back to back. Quizzes every day. Oh, I know. I know. My bad. That only takes 10 minutes, though. Yep. Yeah, and the packets are just an assortment of uh, modules. So yep. It's pretty easy. Right on, buddy. Absences affect you, so if you don't come, it won't affect you. That work is easy, but you gotta come to do it, and that's a problem I'm having, so I complain about that. Right on. I appreciate you guys. We have fun in here, and this is proof I feed you cookies. Come on. We like cookies. If nothing else, if you're getting hard work, you know, sometimes, not every day. Yeah, cookies. It's about the cookies. Welcome to marketing class. All right, we, we have a celebrity sighting right here. This is Michael. <laughs> Sir, what was your favorite elective CTE class? Um, I gotta say marketing. <gasps> you made my day. Of course, of course. Uh, Mr. K is a fun teacher. He Thanks. Helps you, he helps you uh, learn about marketing sales and marketing mix, and marketing conduct. Thanks, buddy. Of course. You made my day. Thank you. Marketing is all about satisfying exchange relationships. It used to be that people would work for a company and they would help the company with marketing. But nowadays, you can be a entrepreneur that has a product that stretches across the world. Individuals like you and me. And marketing is understanding the needs of customers and communicating value to them. I know this because I've been able to reach across the world through social media. I've written seven books and I have created products. As of last fall, I became ambassador to a pretty big brand. I'm not trying to scare you, but when you're done, you're gonna, yeah, you, you'll, you'll have a good, comfortable knowledge of marketing. By now, you guys are probably sick of me talking, so we're gonna pass the microphone. This is Ronald and Joshua, and uh, they had me for computer applications class. They're going to tell you about it. So computer applications is a class where you could learn how to use Microsoft, Excel, um, it's called PowerPoint, all those type of apps that you could use on your computer. And it helps you learn how to use them. And it's really helpful because in the future, you'll most likely need to use them. Or if not, you still could take the class. It's a really fun class. And yeah, you could you could be really good in it. A computer application class is a really fun class to do. You also, after doing all the programs and all the work you have to do, you get a, a certification for Microsoft that you can use, put in your resume, you can use to put in your college if you say you don't have to take the class anymore. And you can use it to like make a website, like just do work with. And this year, I'm proud to say that we got 100 certifications, exactly 100 certifications. And some would say that is the first step on taking over the world. All right, the question is, now that you have Microsoft certifications, how do you plan on taking over the world? By, every, by making everything monetizable. I'm gonna, make every, I'm gonna make money advertising everything that involves me. I love it. How about you? I don't know if I would take over the world, but uh, I think that I would make it easier with the certifications. I think I've learned enough to strive for better in my life and I think I'll make money off of it. Excellent. And now it is time to wait for a Hempstead legend. 
Hempstead legend, Miss Beverly Mitchell. Do you see that lady right there? She is a legend at Hempstead. And if there was one class that I would choose to take, uh, I've seen this so many times, it is business law. You have that worked down to an art form. Thank now, you. it's the truth. Now, just like the students, I'm putting Miss Mitchell on the spot right here. Could you give us a sound bite about business law? What's that class all about? Making ethical and legal correct decisions. Okay. If no one's watching you, are you still going to do the right thing? Okay. And even if someone is watching you, how will you represent yourself? So business law is pretty much looking at different businesses and what they entail, and also the laws that apply for them. So for example, it's like contracts, like how does a contract start, how a contract is enforced, whether it's legal or not, and anything else that can apply to it. So for example, minors cannot enter a contract, it's just illegal, they void it. So there's just no way that if you're a minor, you can agree to a contract, in which case it's no and void. Business law is a really good class where you can choose when you're in the high school years. You can learn from laws, different type of cases, what can be in the other side and the other, like think about two people. So mm -hmm. it's a really good one if you can choose, if you want to learn in the future, you can do take like a major, you can take like the best skills to learn about business law. It's a really good class. Okay. Business law, I aprendido mucho. Uh, me ha ayudado bastante a saber sobre las leyes de Estados Unidos. Y es algo que me va a ayudar en el futuro. Y pues, la verdad que es muy buena y les recomiendo que la tomen porque les ayudará mucho. Fair enough. So would you say that this is a class that if you want to be a lawyer, uh, this is the class that you should take? Sure, of course it is. I mean, you, you need this as a basis. And in fact, today we're actually going to look over criminal law, which for some people who might want to go on cases such as that, you can come in here to learn about it, including other laws, such as before a contract we're not done yet. I think we're done. Let's go. A219. Let's go. Hi, I'm Mrs. Ortman. I am a business teacher here at Hempstead High School. I teach two different classes, careers, and virtual enterprises. And we're going to introduce you to the virtual enterprise team today. Virtual enterprises is a class that is an entrepreneurship class where students run the program throughout the school year. They participate in six to eight different field trips and competitions where they write a business plan about their company and share it and compete against other schools on Long Island and in the New York region. Here we go. Hi, my name is Caitlin and I am the CEO of Pollery. Pollery is the company that we created in Virtual Enterprise and Pollery is our jewelry brand where we carry luxury products in gold and silver catering to men and women. Our company has five departments, marketing, HR, finance, slash accounting, sales, and design. This class can help you learn a lot about business. It teaches you business skills, leadership skills, time management, social skills, and adaptivity. Overall, this class is extremely beneficial for those who are interested in learning business and entrepreneuring. Now, I'm going to hand it over to Isaiah and Steph to talk about their experience through Virtual Enterprise. Hi, my name is Isaiah. Since the start of VE, I've gained experience from the class through building a business from scratch. LIU is also connected to VE where I was able to receive a scholarship from. Hi guys, it's Stephanie again and I'm also in the Virtual Enterprises class and I am Chief Marketing Officer. Now in VE we also learn a lot about business and it has been a tough journey. There's been instances where we don't know what we're doing and sometimes we have to ask outside sources for help but overall it's been a good experience and I feel like I've learned a lot regarding business and has definitely helped in me wanting to keep pursuing a business major. Hi, my name's Melody Torsivia. I'm a business teacher here at Hempstead High School. As you can see, it's at the end of the school day, so it's kind of quiet here at the atrium. Um, I teach several different classes. I teach, uh, right now I'm take, teaching accounting and uh, business law and CFM, which is known as career and financial management. Um, I like all my classes, but the thing I particularly like about career and financial management is it gives the kids um, a lot of guidance and financial um, 
information to make the best decisions when they get out of school. We talk about interviewing, how to get that job, how to do a good interview so they can get that um, position that they want their first job. Um, we cover a lot of different aspects of financial, um, how to invest your money, how to um, use uh, credit cards in a wise way, in a smart way. And, um, and we talk about uh, writing out checks. We talk about um, in, uh, investing, uh, bank accounts, um, checking into different bank accounts, which one would be best for a new student, and uh, practicing um, just you know, writing out checks. A lot of different things that, um, that are relevant skills that they're going to use as they move into the real world. So it's a great class for any student to have. It's a lot of classes um, in the business department um, allow you to be more savvy out there in the business world. So the business department has a great selection of classes that are good for all students. Hi, this is Ms. Vajar here at Hempstead High School Assistant Principal. I hope you guys were able to learn just a little bit about the CTE program. We have so much to offer. Now the question is, why CTE? And the answer is simple. We want to provide you as much skill sets that we can during high school so that you could be ready and prepared to enter the workforce and or college. We want to develop your skill sets here at Hampstead because we know we have great teachers that could provide you the right pathway to success. And finally, we want to enhance your resume. What a beautiful thing to say, I'm a Hempstead High School graduate, I have an advanced regents, and I enter the CTE pathway. I have Microsoft Office Suites certification, I have QuickBooks certification, I attended VE class, I'm practically a chef. I know how to cook thanks to the culinary class, and finally, I'm able to sew. We want to develop skill sets required to become a more independent individual. I hope you enjoyed the CTE fair and we will welcome and love to welcome all of you to our program. Bye.